It's me, LaRasha, Goddess Queen, Just Me, 23, and this is going to be your collective reading for the overall collective. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you have been here for a while, thank you for supporting me. If you are new to my channel, um, I do things different than uh, other tarot readers. You can see um, that if you continue to, you know, be a part of my tribe, make sure you like, subscribe, hit that notification button to let you know that you're notified when you get these re my videos get uploaded I will tell you you probably will not get a notification even if you are subscribed because there's still people that is my subscribers that are not getting their notifications and that's been going on since 2018 um so just welcome Pisces uh this reading again is going to be for Pisces sun moon rising Venus Mercury north node Guided to this video, if you don't have Pisces in your chart and not dealing with anybody that has Pisces in their chart, maybe there are some messages in this video for you too. Cuss babies, I include you in my readings because your son represents who you're trying to be before you pass over in this lifetime. So if I state your date of birth, that means that you're a cuss baby. If I don't state your date of birth, that means that you're a regular um, Pisces when it comes to your son position, okay? So Aquarius slash Pisces, February the 15th through February the 21st. Aquarius slash Pisces, February the 15th through February the 21st. First, and then uh, Pisces slash Aries, March the 17th through March the 23rd. Pisces slash Aries, March the 17th through March the 23rd. I am going to go ahead and say happy birthday to you, Pisces, um, because again, tomorrow is the 15th. Today is the 14th, which is, you know, if you still celebrate the val uh, Valentine's, the people are celebrating Valentine's, um, but tomorrow is, you know, the cusp energy when it comes to you. So I do want to say happy birthday. We do have a full moon, I believe, that's coming up as well. I think a moon, there's a moon phase that's coming. Oh, I had my rings. I forgot to put my ring on. I just ordered some rings. Um, but make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. If you are new to this channel, welcome. If you have been here for a while, thank you for supporting me when it comes to, you know, uh, um, I think this is, okay. Thank you for supporting me when it comes to, you know, who, uh, when you, if, when you representing who you are and then also being a part of my soul tribe. Oh, so this is a size eight. Okay. So eight goes on my finger over here. I don't want to take that off. So let me put it over here. It's going to be a little bit mishmash. I just put my new ring on here. Okay. So we got, uh, uh, Lost my train of thought. Okay, again, getting ready to be your birthday. It's Aquarius season, getting out of the Aquarius uh, season, going into Pisces. So make sure that you do protect your emotions, especially during your month. Again, a lot of moon energy when it comes to shadow energy, dark night of the soul, you know, being more in your uh, darker part of your energy than you are in your light. Um, so just make sure that you protect your energy. Don't allow anybody to come in and drain you because you being in a uh, water side. OK, um, so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, so Pisces, sun, moon, rising, Venus, Mercury, North Node guided to this video. If you don't have Pisces in your chart and not dealing with anybody that has Pisces in their chart, maybe there are some messages in this video for you, too. So Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mercury, North Node, 
guided to this video if you don't have Pisces in your chart. So we got the King of Wands. So you got Aries, Leos, Willis, Sagittarius. That's the card that I switched over. You got the Five of Pentacles. So somebody could be coming out of abandonment when it comes to a fire sign. You got Gemini energy. So they possibly, this fire sign could have abandoned you in the past. Now they're coming in with this love offer. This reading came, this energy came out in my Taurus reading as far as these two cards. Um, so somebody definitely could be seeing you as a love um, relationship after some type of form of abandonment if you abandoned them pisces or if they abandoned you okay is what i'm hearing there was some type of abandonment yeah third party situation i feel like this fire sign or you put this fire sign in a third party situation could have been with a gemini or another suitor i feel like somebody is getting over the heartache and the pain when it comes to abandonment in a third party relationship this masculine in the past could have chose somebody over you um, if they chose somebody over you, this other person could have left them abandoned when it comes to a certain situation. Empress energy, they see you as the Empress. This also came out in the Taurus reading. So again, um, you could have um, two different suitors um, that could be choosing, you could be choosing from, you could be abandoning one of them because the other one is coming in and making a choice for you. That's what I said in the Taurus reading. The Pisces, I feel like this uh, king of wands sees you as their empress you have taurus slash libra energy here so this person sees you as wifey material they see you as somebody that's very abundant you're independent you carry your own you have a lot of suitors that admire you okay um you possibly been up through a lot of experiences when it comes to relationships again you know uh putting yourself back together when it comes to building your confidence it shows that you don't need anybody there like you don't need anybody when it comes to money they're an extra benefit to whatever it is that you already have and that could be one thing that this a masculine admires about you when it comes to you know uh choosing you as the suitor so we got pisces sun moon rising so you got the five of swords so there could have been some deception as far as when it comes to trickering one up wanting up you in this relationship or again that other person that they were involved with i feel like deceive them they see this person as a wolf in sheep clothing when it comes to this person putting them in a third party situation is what i'm hearing so if there was a form of abandonment this masculine is coming in and apologizing for that for their reckless behavior when it comes to them again running with the wolves instead of running with you so we have the six of swords and so somebody is definitely escaping a situation when it comes to like i told you being around the wrong individuals that brought a relationship to coming into this type of some form of abandonment right now this masculine is moving towards you this also represents the messenger of love it also represents a, a, a love proposal when it comes to that somebody coming in with an offer there's a box here so you got the page of swords you got the four of pentacles so somebody definitely was moving more off of ego pride um, you know, obsession. I feel like this masculine could be coming in as far as when it comes to their approach with you. They could be coming in with, you know, petty communication or very little communication. But the communication that they're coming in is going to, I feel like this masculine is getting around like, uh, you're mine and nobody else's. I heard that you were dealing with somebody so and so and so and so. So this is where this masculine is going to get ready to, you know, flip the script on you when it comes to him showing you how possessive he really is and obsessive of your energy um even if there was some type of abandonment or if he was putting you in a third party situation i feel like this masculine is getting ready to show their obsession for you your minds and minds only is what the energy i'm hearing yeah the ace of wands aries leo's will of sagittarius this came out in the taurus reading this came out in taurus reading too so you are true with fulfillment to this masculine so you somebody's getting ready to come in fast in a hurry with some type of communication saying you mind you know you better leave them snakes alone i realize that everybody else i was dealing with blah 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 they can't amount to your greatness you know you are the person that i want to be with let's see what's going to be at the bottom even though we don't need another card yeah we got the two we got um too many cards okay Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Uh, just want to mix it and then I'm going to see what's at the bottom. Okay. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. They're coming in with an offer. You are wish fulfillment to this person. You could be a little bit guarded when this masculine comes in and gives you this offer because it's coming out of nowhere when it comes to, you know, if, especially if there has been abandonment in this relationship. You know, if they uh, 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 ghosted you or anything like that, put you on standstill, you ain't expecting for this masculine to come in with this possessive energy when it comes to you. So you got Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mercury, North Node. Guided to this video if you don't have Pisces in your chart and not dealing with anybody that has Pisces in your chart. Maybe there's some messages in this video for you too.
We have control issues. Yep. Form of control. So I told you, obsession. They're getting ready to show you their control, uh, how they control. Like in the past, they probably could have been, you know, a little bit, in, you know, petty when it comes to them showing their aggression when it comes to this relationship and their obsession. But now they really finna show you. <laughs> By trying to control this situation, you only uh, slow down your answer prayers. Let the vine take the lead. So this master could have tried to be petty when it comes to this connection, you know, ghosting you, abandoning you. And then you could have sailed away to an other opportunities, other situations. You over here, this empress, everybody's admiring you. Now this master's like, no, nah, they on this mind energy. You are mine and nobody else's. This harmony okay this is making this masculine upset again he's seeing that you you are not being loyal to this connection or again you out there playing with the wolves and he was out there playing with the wolves it says but he was out there playing with the wolves first so it says there seems to be some disconnect use the time to address any issues to restore harmony in this relationship this is going to be how he going to re restore harmony in this relationship okay um this is the divine union card was reversed so i feel like somebody is ending a third party situation and going towards something else so let's say if they did choose somebody else and thought that that person was the divine counterpart they left you abandoned for that other connection now they seeing the dishonor in that relationship there could have been control issues when it comes to this other partner that they were involved with so it says congratulations it's time to celebrate both you and your partner have healed and learned the important lessons to allow this union to manifest so one more card pisces and we have explore so somebody definitely could have been trying to control this masculine from going towards you or control you from going towards this masculine as far as when it comes to exploring it could be travel somebody could have stopped your masculine from going towards your house or are you going towards their house that was could have been a form of control it could have been a mother um influence or another woman influence when it comes to their controlling i feel this masculine now realize let's say if they your masculine was in this petty energy i'm not going to go to her i'm not going to do this i'm not going to do that i'm just going to leave her in this abandonment energy i'm not going to explore this connection the way that i need to again they overstepped their control and possibly again poss could have lost them lost you and put them own self in a third party situation so i feel like this masculine and now is you know um realizing the disharmony as far as when it comes to their own actions and when it comes to a third party situation so it says take a ride to explore new scenery each and each other's uh inner thoughts yeah breakup so i feel like somebody's going through a breakup and then somebody's going to a union okay so pisces either you are this masculine's going through a breakup and like I said, and this person had control issues and now they're exploring and moving towards you because they're letting go of this situation. So it says time apart is on the horizon. This may be short term or long term. So somebody could be ending a relationship, right? There's no only energies that we have here is fire, Aries, Leo's, Willis, Sagittarius, Taurus, slash Libra. You have Gemini energy here. And then you got the Page of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, as well as Gemini, Ace of Wands, Aries, Leo's, Willis, Sagittarius. And then you got this Ace of Pentacles over here. So this is the energies here. So again, somebody could be exiting in a relationship and going to explore a new relationship. Okay. And I'm going ahead and ending this reading. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. And you have a great day.